definitely remember my first time at Circle Loco. Yeah, it was about seven, eight years ago now. Basically watching Tanya Volcano, Dan Ganassia, Clive Henry um, all do their thing on the terrace. That was the standout for me. And it was actually when it all became clear to me that it was what I actually wanted to try and try and pursue myself. I only played there for the first time last summer, but I've obviously been going there to party for like, yes, let me say seven, seven, eight years. I'm going to be doing um, Circle Loco again and um, enter Richie Horton's night at Space. I do that in August. Um, I have a North America tour coming up in a couple of weeks where I'm playing Chicago, San Francisco, uh, Mexico, Texas. I've got Eastern Electrics Festival in England, in London. I go to Australia to do a four-day festival tour in September, October time. And other than that, I'm just in and around Europe. Check it out. going to Sona for a long time and I used to go there when I was just partying obviously before I started DJing and uh, it's a really nice experience to actually be going back there and actually playing. Um, Left Room Corporate was amazing. I did two parties on the Friday night and then one party on the Thursday night. Didn't stay for very long unfortunately because I had to um, leave to go and play in Switzerland. I sort of wish I'd uh, taken the weekend off. <laughs> It was my first time in Detroit, actually. Well, my first time at the festival. I've played in Detroit once before, but it was my first time at uh, Movement. It was amazing. Yeah, it was a true honor to be asked to play. I couldn't have asked for more, really. It was an amazing day. The only downside was it rained. <laughs> it was literally the second I started playing, it started raining. So apart from that, it was, it was amazing. I um, seem to have the rain following me around the world at the moment. Um, I played in, when I played in Miami it rained, when I played in Detroit it rained, when I played in Canada it rained, when I play everywhere it seems to rain. It seems to have broken the, uh, the jinx recently, like the jinx I think has stopped, there's been a bit of sunshine recently, so fingers crossed. I did obviously the Romanthony remix with with um, Gavin uh, Herlihy recently, and um, and then that yeah the Dusky was the next one along, and then I obviously did the Culprit one. I did the the one for Bernsky and Manic because they're friends of mine. So I, and obviously Culprit is a label close to home because it teams up with with Left Room and Drew the Drew guys. And then other than that, I've just been trying to concentrate on original material really. There's so little time. Time is pretty precious at the moment, particularly in the studio. So I'm just trying to um, to get as much original stuff down as, as possible. <laughs> <laughs> 